Hello, I'm Chorpsoy. I'm the J.S. Spade. I'm back from anime hell. Also, I'm Tayok. I'm Future Friends. And we're here for a brand new Let's Play. Wow. I thought this was the old LP. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry. I'm going back to my roots. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> going back to your old neighborhoods. <laughs> Man, I love a dog's life. <laughs> no, Man, this game Yeah, this is, is also better. a Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 4. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm back in anime hell. <laughs> no, welcome to Chulip. That PS2 classic. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> I heard you could buy that game on the game stuff. <laughs> it's pretty <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Just like you can get from Japan. Whoop. Whoa, um, this game is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> These guys are nuts. You're wearing a hat. <laughs> All right, Chorps, you should make this a funny name. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't worry. Let's like, see what uh, you got. It's the funny. It's the funniest character name I could think of. Oh, oh yeah, but, but, I'm ready. I'm ready. Mm. Are you putting in your own name? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, look. Fuck? That's the saddest name. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is your self-insert fan fiction, be a weirdo. I believe it's important to roleplay <laughs> in any game I play. <laughs> hey, trolls, get this guy. He's a freak. Oh, <laughs> uh, you better name her after me. Yeah. I named her after the only true love I know. I mean, you don't need to make excuses if you just want to, you know, like, have an excuse to kiss a lot of people <laughs> in the cyber world. Don't need to <laughs> fucking drag us into this. <laughs> You're getting sicker by the moment, Charles. <laughs> Who would ever want to kiss anime? <laughs> yeah. It's me. He was a chorps, she was an anime. Can I make it any more obvious? <laughs> <laughs> and so, a beautiful story of love begins between me <laughs> and my one true love. Japanese cartoons. <laughs> I like how between the pixelation and the resolution and the art style from the side, she just literally looked like, the, like an insect. <laughs> also, Chirps, you missed out by not calling her Japanimation. <laughs> there weren't enough letters. Oh, this is like the start to My Neighbor Totoro. <laughs> it's exactly like that. Yeah, you're gonna kiss the big cat, and it's gonna be the new <laughs> meme you see on Chirps. So, um, you know, like, uh, let's talk a little bit about our Tulip experience here, why don't we? Uh, Tulip never came to Europe, so I know that you and Teok have never played it. <laughs> yes, nope. I desperately wanted to. I saw an LP of this, like, back in the day, and I thought, this game looks really fun. Like, well, fun isn't the right word, but, like, it looks it's interesting. It's interesting. Yes. Yeah, and I'm. It was like, from what I gather, a GameStop only release in the US. It was weird because it also took like five years to localize, and the localization didn't finish either. <laughs> wow. Like, it's a surprise that it made it to the US at all. So it didn't finish entirely in what way? There's some stuff that is not translated, um, no dialogue stuff. Okay, so just straight up in Japanese, then. Yeah, and I've gotten <laughs> someone to help translate those bits. But it doesn't affect the dialogue, it just affects some of the, like, graphics and some of the, like, in-between chapter stuff. Hmm. It's a weird... it's a weird thing, there's a lot of troubled history behind it. But, uh, it's, it's a game that's very interesting and, I think, charming. Despite being sort of, like, plagued by a lot of early open-world gameplay issues. <laughs> like, before they figure out how to make a lot of this stuff fun. But anyways, we've moved to a nice, quaint, 
a Japanese suburban town. And it's time to go meet our neighbors. Nice. And we come to village idiots. <laughs> Jesus, it's that's me, horrifying. Shack boy, I live in the shack. <laughs> <laughs> But in Boston, first the best moment it in Boston. Funny Bone City. Yeah, <laughs> like city folk are out there, they're gonna sneak into our house at night and shoot us. <laughs> <laughs> it's a best moment. But uh, one thing that is consistent with all of the other characters' opinions about us is that they think we're poor, and know we're poor, and we'll constantly bring up the fact that we're poor. <laughs> wow, it's just like me in real life. <laughs> <laughs> you go to meet your neighbors at your new apartment, it's like, oh, hey, you're the poor kid. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> which is weird, because I'm 44. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we'll pretend we weren't eavesdropping on their horrible conversation. God, they look like vegetables that have been brought to life. <laughs> he looked like a nice kid who nonetheless is not affluent. <laughs> oh, I see how it is. Talking shit, now you want to hang out? <laughs> yeah. You're a fake friend, aren't you? <laughs> This lady is going to eat us. Watch out for her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I didn't want to talk to you. No. <laughs> Not again. Ah! Oh, Stop that. It's my first chance. Anyways, I guess we should know about this guy in case we ever get sick and are on health care. We're too poor for health care, though. <laughs> oh, Dr. Dandy. Give us a discount, please. <laughs> I agree. I love the stock crow sound effect so much. <laughs> this game is making me scream it's that bad. I think they use that stock crow sound in Lisa. They do. <laughs> they use a number of stock animal sounds in this game, depending on the time. <laughs> Even though you're such a poor little shit. Haha. -ha. <laughs> yeah, see? Everyone already knows we're poor. That's the one thing everyone knows about us. This guy lives in a trailer. Doesn't have a job. But yet he can go, oh, it's the poor kid. <laughs> well, he's rich in life experience, chirps. Right. You can tell because he has a guitar. He plays music. <laughs> yeah, 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 he gets laid a ton. <laughs> He's an artist. <laughs> I mean, they know you're poor because the greatest wealth is love and you have not kissed a single person yet. Right. You can see up top, my, uh, my love is very small. I only have five to give away. Ah. Oh. I feel a little bad for that dog, because he never leaves his doghouse. It's just, like, attached to him. Hey, that's like me and Ben. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably really fat and just can't get out. I mean, at least now you know where you can get cheap pot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good to know where your dealer is as soon as you get into town. Yeah, take notes. <laughs> <gasps> and there she is! Oh, the God. woman of my dreams. She looks like a muppet baby. <laughs> 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 this will never get tired for me. <laughs> wow! What? <laughs> That's very wow, direct. She's really forward. <laughs> Here's the speed run strats, nah. <laughs> well, great LP. I hear it's important to be honest in a relationship, so that's what I'm gonna do. Damn, she's oh, okay, savage! savage. <laughs> so, <laughs> Why? Why? That, that sounds like a poor person name. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what's a rich person named Chirps? Future friends. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you yeah, if kidding. you had named yourself Future Friend, you'd already be in Smooch City. 
<laughs> By the way, did you know I do LPs and be like, oh, hell yes. Yeah, you know that show Cougar Town? That's where I live. <laughs> Every day of my life, buddy. <laughs> you know the show Gilmore Girls? That's where I live. <laughs> That's right, there's a dedicated kiss button in this game. Oh, it's like a uh, Shadow of Mordor. Exactly! <laughs> this is an important life lesson for all the people out there. Don't just kiss people. This is the kind of relationship I want, where, like, the woman takes the lead and tells me how to kiss people. <laughs> right, and that you're poor, but smart. So she lies to Except me. Except for here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, wow. You're going to chill, Chorps. <laughs> so for all the different characters, if you try to kiss them before their time, they will hit you for a varying amount of damage. So that top bar is basically like self-esteem <laughs> in terms of, like, in its health. So if you run out, you die because your heart's been broken. Are you sure it's not the amount of time before someone calls the police? <laughs> yeah, this is an open world game. Does it have like a, a wanted system like in GTA? When do you jack a car? Hey, you should kiss that doctor and marry him. Then you won't be so poor anymore. <laughs> we'll get to the idea of a wanted system later. <laughs> <laughs> there might be something to that. Oh, Dad. Aw, oh, shucks. Dad's always so good at giving me self-esteem. <laughs> Is that how you regain health? Just, like, talk to your dad? He says, I love you, son. <laughs> yes. This is, like, the opposite of my conversations with my parents. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> oh. You're a disappointment, and I go in for a kiss, and he slaps me. <laughs> Dad, you've been unpacking for over 12 hours now. I think you should get on that. <laughs> he has to be very careful with his uh, anime collection. Right. <laughs> like father, like son. <laughs> Doesn't want anything to happen to all of his Funko Pops. <laughs> his, Excuse his me, they're called Mendoroids. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, please, he only goes for the hottest merchandise. Yeah. <laughs> his Funko Pops better cost a trillion dollars or he ain't buying them. <laughs> That's why you're so poor. Your dad is an addict. <laughs> Why didn't you kiss your father? This is fucked up. He's he's busy. Okay. He's trying to work, and I've got to go find a letter set so I can write a love letter. <laughs> I like how you're just kind of like creeping on her while you walk <laughs> on by. <laughs> just, hey, baby. <laughs> But he hates me more than anything in the world. <laughs> well, I think Rocky's home wherever he goes because he literally like carries his home on his back. <laughs> oh, that's right. Anyways, we might as well ask Badian if we can borrow it. Uh oh. Ah, uh, this is Cheap Pot's scam. He sells people items and then he gets his dog to steal them back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't think you should kill, uh, kiss that guy. <laughs> he sounds like a fiend. He sounds like he's a, too much of a bad boy for you, chorps. <laughs> Well, 
Maybe Cheapot will know what to do. Oh, okay. That's all you got for me? Let me teach you how to creep. <laughs> hey, I already know that, Tayok. I know that from the day I was born. I mean, it's not so much that you know it, rather than you are it, but... Damn. Wow. Snake, if you hit the triangle button, you can give your opponent a quick smooch. <laughs> so, with characters who have, like, the steam coming out of their head, if you try to approach them normally, they'll attack you in some way, like that dog barked at us. But if you sneak... They won't react. Hmm. Like, even if they can see you sneaking? Yes. Huh. Well, in most cases. Oh, well, cool. We just get it from him. For free. <laughs> also, he's gonna kill a dog. Are you gonna do anything <laughs> about that? <laughs> It looks like he doesn't care, so we got a free thing. Cool. Cool. Why would his real life work like this? <laughs> hey, anime, I'm going to write a love letter to you. Bye. I let a guy kill a dog. I love you. <laughs> Signed shirts. Are you proud of me, Dad? <laughs> <laughs> Roses are red, violets are blue. I can't think of word to rhyme Sundari with. <laughs> hey, hey, don't have that kind of talk in here, Jay. <laughs> well, let's home this cool letter set we found. It's not his, but maybe it'll be just as good. <laughs> Damn, thanks, Dad. Let's just ignore the part where we let man try to kill a dog. However, this letter set doesn't have cool love lift print, so it's not good enough. <laughs> yeah, Dad, your love letter set had a weed sign on it, and this one doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> I think the cops are gonna arrest us. <laughs> I love the idea of ending a love letter with end. <laughs> yeah, not your signature. <laughs> it's like a Jason Voorhees movie. <laughs> and? <laughs> and then you're gonna write the question mark in your own blood. <laughs> Dad, Dad's so proud of the love letter he hasn't seen. I hope the neighbors don't read it either. <laughs> I'd love if he read it and like, uh, no, you can't send this. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, your dad is like, son, we need to talk about social etiquette. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so we can open our inventory and sh we can use any item on anyone. Not always will it be useful or interesting, but we can. It's our town's <laughs> custom to mail letters. <laughs> We're kind of weird here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, specifically love letters they mail, and you can't just hand it to someone. Whereas everywhere else, you just take the letter and uh, fold it up into a little paper plane and try to hit someone with it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's like a Cupid's arrow, but a little bit That's less how aerodynamic. That's I to my ex-wife. <laughs> I hit her in the eye. <laughs> she's blank now. <laughs> Is that why she's your ex-wife? <laughs> well, yeah. I also did that with the divorce papers. <laughs> Straight to cut the other eye. <laughs> you hit her in the eye with a love letter that she married you and then immediately divorced you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I did. <laughs> I'm the man here. Oh, oh at wait, first I thought you were putting your letter in the garbage. <laughs> That's where it belongs. Where it belongs. I mean, but... I mean, you were going to deliver your letter to anime, so... <laughs> and thankfully, she's not in on it. I showed her the letter. She doesn't know. I think this game has good capitalist values. <laughs> um. That guy was moving us. Let's kick his ass. Bye. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, I'm sure that'll never come back. But it did open a new area of the town, which we'll get to once we show everyone our cool love letter. Now I'm actually kind of hoping that we never see him again. <laughs> Not because I hate him, but because, like, just... Hey, here's a telephone pone, man. Okay, that's it. <laughs> I hate him. He had a bad opinion. It's like, treat your employees with care. <laughs> <laughs> pay your workers. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, future friend, when are you gonna pay us? <laughs> hey, 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 ask next month. <laughs> you give the letter to her directly and the police just tackle you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 put it in the mailbox. <laughs> Yeah, as we saw before, he opened up a side of town, so let's, uh, let's walk through the tunnel. The tunnel of love. Maybe. Wow. It's great. <laughs> uh, you see me fixing my hair? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh no, the industry is doomed. <laughs> <laughs> I need to go now. Ah, see, we're already meeting her parents. <laughs> Sharps, you are moving kind of fast. <laughs> well, look, we gotta we gotta get to know the whole family first. Same. I mean, it's good that the the doctor can come over to this part of town now because anime's mom looks like the fucking ship from Fantasy Zone. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, her dad looks like one of the Maui hats from Gradius, so it's a match made in heaven. <laughs> Only two beings this grotesque could ever give birth to anime. <laughs> 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 I, I expected his hurt head to just turn like 360. Hey, how's it going, guys? Uh, I want to marry your daughter. <laughs> Aren't you that poor kid? I need to go now. No! Hey, I want hey, to talk no. to the other guy. We hey, let him speak to the for himself. Man in charge. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why does everyone know this? <laughs> Hey, you want to check out this love letter I wrote to your daughter? <laughs> I can tell. It's got the little heart to seal the envelope. <laughs> oh, damn! Oh, Whoa! Boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, your Great daughter start. said we were pretty smart. I need to go now. Can Maybe she was reverse necking you. <laughs> Maybe. I need to go now. I need to go now. Now I see why she ran away from home. <laughs> Her parents are so judgmental. <laughs> I would be too if I looked like a Muppet baby. <laughs> <laughs> it always looks like there's a theater on this side of town, which is nice. <laughs> <laughs> and here's a nice old lady who will eventually sell us candy and stuff. Gee, spoilers. She said she ran the snack shop. So, is there actually a timer in this game or something now that she mentions like time? There will be. Oh, God. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> It's like somebody became a mascot of you. <laughs> Eventually, the game 
will have a 24 hour timer. But for now, while we get accustomed to the town, we don't have those restrictions. I'm pretty sure that character on the left is like one of the characters from the uh, toy chapter of Ill Bleat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he does kind of yeah. look like the cowboy. <laughs> Or like a really bad Funko Pop, bringing My it back. sexy doll! <laughs> hey, oh, we are a sexy doll! It's called a Nendoroid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the officer here. You're poor, so you're coming with me, son. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a crime to be poor in America. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Come on. I thought police were supposed to be impartial. <laughs> so to note, his name is just Policeman. <laughs> I can sense the kiss crimes on you. <laughs> his name is Conductor. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't believe we've begun with the fucking profiling already. <laughs> Yeah, you really shouldn't let a person's job define who they are. Well, not only that, but everyone thinks, oh, you probably put the rock on the train tracks. <laughs> you this is tiny garbage. child probably put this rock here. Why did we move away from the big city? This is the worst. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like this is worse. <laughs> everyone knows who we are. Did, was her dad like a serial killer there when <laughs> you move away to this shitty town? Yeah, Jesus. Do you think the police officer has, like, an inner ear infection or something like that? <laughs> oh, why, he can't balance? Maybe. No, he just have- he doesn't have a neck, he's just- it's just literally a slinky. <laughs> he's a- yeah, he's a bobblehead doll. <laughs> well, here's the mailbox. Thank God. <laughs> it's almost like there's no attendance to it, and it's just a box. <laughs> It's actually a trash can. <laughs> the upper part is the trash can, the, uh, the lower part is the incinerator. <laughs> oh god, is the mailbox talking to us? Is this Majora's Mask all over again? <laughs> <laughs> oh damn! <laughs> <Whoa>! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, kid. <laughs> Honestly, you probably should never go into someone's room if they tell you that. <laughs> well, that was weird. Time to go find someone's room. And we can search all across town for it, but I already know where this man lives. Wait a minute, Chores. Have you played this game before? Are you cheating? <laughs> you might be surprised. Oh man, are you sequence breaking? <laughs> you didn't no, tell me this was I a speed run. I had to try so hard not to sequence break because there's so many things you can just ignore. <laughs> this is actually a task. Anyways, it looks like that sewer grating is talking to us. <laughs> oh, God. We're going to meet the Rat King. <laughs> All right. Back where you belong. <laughs> Seems I good. think we're going to be eaten by a chut. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh, hello, Mr. Satter. Uh, oh, it all makes wow. sense now. Chud 3 looks bad. I don't like the monster there. I really wish the Chuds had stayed at college. <laughs> yeah. You know, I think it went off the rails with butt to Chud, but <laughs> wow, this is even worse. <laughs> oh, it's an apartment. <laughs> oh, He's supposed right. to be here. Looks homey. <laughs> I thought it Come better on. to ask than to, than to be rude about it. I mean, this guy's been rude to you before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did tell us our love letter was terrible. I dare criticize my writing. <laughs> I'll have you know. I'm a top 12 writer on fanfiction.net and the Wolverine section. 
I was the man who made Logan and Silver Samurai kiss under the cherry blossom tree. <laughs> <laughs> you take it back. Yeah, it's yeah. heaven now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, everyone knows our status because oh, of so our that's level. Your class, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Charps, play your class for once. <laughs> Stop trying to kiss people and start being poor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. God, that. <laughs> anyway, uh, Mr. Suzuki here is t here to teach us uh, the kissing mechanics. <laughs> she looks like a sack boy. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, with non, like, story important uh, residents, they'll have movements like this, where for a certain time, they'll be angry, and eventually they will become prone in a state called Viva. And that's when you go in for the kill. <laughs> cool. <laughs> um. <laughs> there are. We did it! Uh huh. <laughs> and people say video games are dark. <laughs> yeah, right? They're like, uh, see, here's the problem with modern video games. They don't get romance like Tulip gets oh, romance. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Bioware, it's all like, oh, give them an egg every day. And it's like, that's not how the real world works. <laughs> yeah, in a real world, you give them an onion because it's what ladies love. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In the real world, you have to sneak up on them when they're mad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't think we should tell our dad what we did. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we get experience points for kissing, and the people we kiss will pay us for it. Like that lady who gave us 80, probably cents, realistically. It's probably based on yen, so we got like 80 cents. Ah, nice. We could get like half a gumball. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's about what I know grandmas to pay out. I was about to say that that seems kind of sketchy, but the amount of money just makes it seems like kind of sad. Like it's charity. <laughs> yeah. You did okay, kid. Oh, he uh, he finished up uh, the move in. Here, take this and please go away. Yeah, you've got a million dollar <laughs> smile and an 80 cents pair of lips. <laughs> <laughs> Where? And by bed, we mean... Oh, I was oh. just about to say, go into the closet, <laughs> but apparently, yes, that is actually... That's where they keep the bed. Yeah, you don't know anything about Japan, Tayok. <laughs> oh, no. The police are after him. <laughs> And so every time we go to sleep, our dad will somehow know all the people we kissed. Well, it's in the paper. It's like the obituaries. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but like the opposite. Yeah, it's right next to the Garfield comic he's been reading for over three hours. <laughs> <laughs> and then the lover's tree will evaluate us. <laughs> Finally. So, every time we level up, we get a few more hearts added to our self-esteem HP. <laughs> That's a cute sound effect. Intimacy leads to popularity. And we level up in our, uh, in our rating. We're now a hard worker, not a poor boy. Uh, now you have to carry the entire team. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, Lover's Tree is just friends with his dad. I get it. <laughs> they yeah. shared a telepathic link. You know, it's no big deal. And dad will always heal us to full. Oh. Aww. I love our Garfield loving dad. <laughs> our Garfield maniac. 